Joining me now is Shelley Horton from 9honey.com.au, Australia's leading website for women. Good afternoon to you, Shelley. Good afternoon. Now, first up, an eagle-eyed royal fan has spotted something new at Buckingham Palace. Oh, I love this so much. So if you look at this photo and you zoom on in, you can see that there's a brand new photo in the Queen's audience room and it's of Meghan and Harry. And it's a photo oh, that we've never I'm zooming seen in. before. Is that next zoom to the light? In. Yep. And you'll actually see it looks like it was taken around their engagement time okay. by the same photographer. And they're just hugging each other and it's a beautiful photo and it's never been seen before. So oh, it's gosh, you about, have to be eagle-eyed, don't you? You have to be eagle-eyed. You have to be a big royal watcher to see that that was a brand new photo. But isn't that nice? She's, she's there clearly... We go. There we go. There we go. Oh, it's <laughs> blurry, it but there it is. Yeah. yeah. Well, that just shows she really is fond of the couple. It really is. And also, Megan's been very reciprocal in that, saying how she thinks the Queen's an incredible woman and has, you know, given up so much to, to lead. And I actually think that this is really a sign that she's uh, part of the family. It's nice, isn't it? All right, like a mummy blog has given a shout out to the Duchess of Cambridge. <laughs> What's this all about? Well, this is a little bit tongue in cheek. So it's uh, Queen Constance Hall, who is a mummy blogger, and she just gave birth to her fifth child. And so she's posed outside the hospital, just like Queen, um, the Duchess of Cambridge. And she's got the red dress, but she's breastfeeding, her eyes are shut. And she's actually got like those support stockings on. And she just put underneath it, Oh, God, Kate, the things they expect of us royals, I hear you, babe. I hear you. <laughs> I love it. It's fun. This is like Instagram version versus real, real life. Real version. <laughs> and a mother of five hats off to her. Exactly. For just, yeah, even putting a red frock on, to be honest. <laughs> well done, Constance. Now, lastly, a young girl, look, she's been accused of racism, but there is more to this story. Yeah, so this is a case of a bit of a Twitter stacks on. So this is about the Santa Fe, Santa Fe uh, shooting that was just back a couple of weeks ago where 10 people were killed in a school. If you look look at the photo, it looks like the white girls are holding hands and then there's one African-American girl who's not holding hands. So there was like accusations of racism on Twitter. However, the girl's mum has come out saying, no, 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 you've cropped the photo. If you go to the other side, none of the other girls are holding hands. And it wasn't a racism incident. It was the fact that the African-American girl was feeling really emotional and she was about to sing and she didn't want to hold hands because she knew she'd cry. So it was one of those cases of people getting outraged for the sake of outrage's sake. And there is always more to the story, isn't there? Don't exactly believe everything you right. see on social media. True. All right, Shelley, thank you so much. And, of course, for all those stories and plenty more, you can head to 9honey.com.au.